guys welcome to Wall of Worship and welcome to my channel today guys we have a huge pleasure to watch lazy kid 19 in his Akatsuki Akatsuki the tier 7 uh, Japanese destroyer and this folks is fourth line it's a domination mode this video it's dedicate a uh, dedication to one of my subscriber Charlie Brown Hi Zera, I'm wondering if you can show me how to play Japanese destroy in conjunction with BB's M uh, uh, cruiser. I find that I try to st uh, start off by spotting, but with a lack of uh, shooters who can hit target, I find myself getting hit within five minutes of start. I play random uh, randoms almost all of the time which is kind of sucks please help me you're my only hope charlie brown jr please folks go and uh, see my bismarck uh, uh, replay and help our friend charlie brown jr and give him some tips and uh, uh, advice from you as a very good uh, destroyer captains now Charlie this replay is for you my friend and the reason I pick and want this one is that you have to know your concealment you I I can see here uh, that this captain has a speed uh, flag it's kind of important don't forget with speed boost and speed flags you're reaching close to what 42.9 it's not bad not bad at all once again Without speed flag, you you have a not not so much speed. With speed flag, I do urge you to have premium um, premium uh, speed boost. If sometimes uh, Charlie, you maybe are in the bad position. Maybe you don't know what to do. Now I do like this captain. He was rushing to be because uh, he has stealth and he thinks that he can cap B. Many players in this particular fourth line always forget about B. I, me, Zera channel, I'm always going B is the first pick I pick. No matter where I spot B, it's probably number one because of some strange reason the people are uh, afraid to go and cap B and what well, you know we can Now my question to you, did this captain do the right thing? Yes, the answer is yes. Now he see this New York, okay he's a tier 5, uh, but the thing is about the Japanese, you have the best torpedoes in this game, tier for tier, you have 9 torpedo, Shiratsuyu can put even 16 torpedoes, but 8 in each and every time, and they do bottle load of damage. And I do believe that news, this New York will sell straight, and I do believe he will eat at least two torpedo. That's my personal op opinion about it. Maybe he's turning. Maybe he will only we eat one. Kind of a weird uh, spread of the torpedoes, to be honest with you. Oh my God, he's going to eat buttloads of torpedoes. Oh man, this New York captain just just selling straight. All right. Four torpedo hits three flooding, he's almost screwed. He's almost dead. Remember, Charlie uh, Brown Jr., you need to know this is the first thing you have to see. Okay, what is my enemy destroyer? It's Shratsuyu Minikaze Grimiashi. You have to be careful with Grimiashi, but on the other hand, you still have enough firepower so you can easily deal delete. And try absolute minikaze. It's just a food for you because it's very low, uh, slow um, to, uh, rate of fire from minikaze. Uh, and shiratsuyu, it's 50 50 percent, you know, depending on how much health the shiratsuyu has. Now, in this particular uh, uh, ship, I'm talking about Akitsuki, Akatsuki, you have more guns than shiratsuyu. Shiratsuyu has one less gun than you. And um, the rate of fire, I do believe it's close to uh, equal. So, you need to see Minikaze is very low, it's ba basically one shot. Number two, if you think that you're spotted, you have to, how should I say, there's one thing important I would like to tell you, Charlie. If you sail away from a BB or a cruiser, and that cruiser is chasing you. If you send torps, 
which that, that means that if a ship are sailing towards you and the torpedo are against that enemy ship the impact will be so close the enemy um, cruiser or battleship have very little time to react what that means charlie is that it's the perfect angle so yes it's not easy to hit someone who's chasing you bow on but the reaction time for that particular play it's almost close to zero and what's your main target uh, 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 charlie brown jr it's the hms hood and all slow battleship but special hms hood but zero what are you talking what well here's the deal the biggest the slowest the uh, uh, how should I say slow turning radius that battleship has the easiest for you as a Japanese destroyer to nuke the hell of that, uh, that uh, ship your hard counterpart uh, Charlie it's not okay crap okay we are this uh, it was um, unfortunately they we got spotted because okay oh man that's a pretty nasty it's three ships versus one you see receive a huge hit and but this captain does not pop the smoke very unfortunately all right Gremiash is shooting at us Nagato oh, now he popped the smoke to let's see how this captain did he wait a couple more seconds to send the torps and he create a bubble so he can sell away right now you know and no one is spotting this captain because he create this nice uh, okay he will eat a lot of torps I do believe this Nagato uh, three flooding and three torpedo hits and just like that we have 93,000 damage and most of that is from torpedo alone and low HP Grimiashi that it's very important someone hit him hard and one more torpedo hit I do believe that was Nagato oh my god that was one good uh, torpedo uh, launch and uh, what happened what happened what happened hood it's also uh, coming in and this captain has reload we are spotted uh, 12 more seconds to the next torpedo dropped congo is has a brain rush uh, how should i say he was deep charging in but we can maybe take the grimash down because he's low hp and he's the biggest threat to be honest with you yes that was sorry folks one hell of a important kill because Grimiashi is not a joke especially when there are three versus one and you see how this captain create a huge big uh, torpedo wall and this team uh, I mean this friendly team they suck hard just look at this how bad they po uh, they play port very very poor because we are way 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 behind points around more than 300 how broken it's that I mean to pull a win from this uh, score it's not even fun to but those torpedo looks good folks holy macaroni folks those torpedo looks absolutely dead on two at least but two it's good enough to take the bloody Nagato now Charlie here's the deal your main focus is not cruiser or any other destroyers beside maybe Minekaze or I don't know how should I say your main focus exactly it's the big slow battleships and especially the captains who likes to sail straight now keep that in mind you have to know a little bit about the secondary it's uh, some battleship you don't ever want to come close in not even with 10 kilometers away uh, and without being spotted and then there's of course the German uh, Tirpitz and Bismarck it's very little versus you but uh, HMS Hood has crappy uh, secondary and crappy turning radius which basically means if this dude is selling straight and I do believe he will sell straight he will eat and l l listen to this uh, Charlie this HMS Hood has 63,500 uh, HP pool that's a lot of uh, HP pool to take care of. and now he went on cap a and this dude does not bother to try to come back and defend and that it's one bad thing now 
keep that in mind you have to watch up how many radar cruiser is on the enemy teams what kind of uh, destroyers are they be afraid of uh, soviet uh, destroyers i knew it i knew this is gonna happen three torpedo hits or cost three floodings and now this HMS Hood is not the health anymore. He had uh, 60 something thousand uh, and now he has more, uh, around half of that HP. Uh, but uh, we are uh, ready to torpedo drop one more time in just a couple more seconds. And try not to just uh, blind uh, the green spot try if you have like three torpedoes launch or even two uh, i usually t take a little bit one left and one right and then create such a pretty awesome good looking wide torpedo wall so if this uh, enemy uh, battleship will try to take left or right at least one because here's the deal the japanese destroyers torpedo are so little you don't need to hit all of them to wreck that thing only one single torpedo will kill this hms hood and we are way 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 behind we need that kill to secure anyway but now we open the fire because uh okay that salvo was uh but remember the hms hood has very slow turret traverse and just one single four hits killed that okay this shiratsuyu it's good bad news situation because he has full hp 11600 which i do believe he's stock he stock shiratsuyu uh, shiratsuyu once again has one less gun it all depends on how good you are to aim versus another Japanese but if that uh, were uh, US or um, German or uh, Russian Russian for crowd out loud no matter if even that thing it's two uh, tiers lower than you don't ever try to gunfight it's because of the uh, the guns basically the guns are very very little versus you as a Japanese destroyer but of course if the enemy destroyer has low HP like that battleship you always go for the guns but keep that in mind that now we are spotted this nice now has good secondary and torpedoes and holy cow now we receive a huge goddamn hit unfortunately of course it was over pen but in this particular case he did the right thing he's speeding away tr try to not be spot because i do believe that this guy now is charging him which is bad for him because now we are not spotted we are still spotted damn it he will have kind of a hard to avoid this uh, torpedo salvo you see that's the kind of a sad part about the japanese destroyer they are kind of slow we put two fires holy macaroni two fires now this dude can actually delete us and the secondaries open up also that it's bad okay we receive but now we have uh, we are not, we have two remaining enemy battleship destroyer. I told you, you see, when someone is chasing a Japanese destroyer, it just was was trying to say before. If you're sailing away and try to get the hell out of there, and send the torps to that direction or create a, such a nice, good-looking wall, the enemy have very little time to disengage because when they see the torps, it's almost too late. But Charlie, I hope that all my advices to you uh, uh, was true and please let me know if you find all this information important. Um, you are the damage dealer, you are the one who has the best torpedoes and in some cases also the best stealth. Disengage if you are too close to an enemy cruiser or battleship. Uh, have this map huge big as, a, as you can do not tunnel vision watch your surrounded where is the threat where can i be more effective unfortunately the enemy uh, shiratsuyu he kept like crazy he kept uh, a c b and a even though this captain was trying to cap uh b and a it's it's 
kind of uh, not had enough with support and I don't know exactly what's going on over here it, this might be a, a, a loss because let's face it even if you try to cap you can not win if anyone uh, is supporting you and try to defend that that B or that in this particular case A nobody uh, would care but okay now we're kind of uh, too close to this uh, Leander it's kind of a dangerous Leander can actually easily take you down now we just disappeared try to not come too close that's my uh, advice to you to a cruiser see what's your range and because you still have almost 100% you have the uh, okay this uh, torpedo wall looks damn good and this Leander is going through the the whole thing fish in the water he, I do believe he wants to stop in the middle of those torpedoes yeah right and Kraken is served folks and just like that before this was an impossible uh, win now the only remaining and there's uh, 3 minutes and 59 seconds left it's Shratsuyu who uh, actually um, kept like crazy now because you have suddenly uh, uh, OK Belfast and Congo on your side you really uh, need to open up at least try to spot for the team the biggest uh, mistake this enemy Shatsuyu did he tried to open fire versus I don't know Congo but as long as uh, Belfast is alive I'm telling you oh the, uh, by the way uh, this is very important if an uh, enemy has Belfast you have to be extremely careful and try to figure out okay this is bad folks now Shiratsu uh, gave such a big, uh, big, uh, big, big, uh, oh man, oof, we have 344, we are, we are one-shotted. Now we kind of need our help. We cannot take any more damage. And this is the right thing, just use go and cap. And because he f fight and uh, shoot at us, now he is visible for 20 more seconds and... Uh, I don't believe there it's time enough. If this Shatsu is smart, he can disengage and he can win. Um, but uh, it's 983. Oh man, this looks bad. Uh, I do believe that this friendly Belfast can play poor, very, very poor. But this game, it's a loss. But anyhow, it's showing you how to in Akatsuki. Thanks guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one. Have a good one. Bye.